Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be my third look in my Alice in Wonderland series. And if you haven't guessed it, I did a evil Alice. I just thought that I could not do a Alice in Wonderland series without doing a Alice makeup. So I decided to make her evil. So this is what I came up with. As usual, I'm going to put all the product lists down below. And let's get started. Alright, so I already have my foundation on. And I'm going to start with the eyes. I'm going to start off, as usual, priming my lids. I'm using a white eyeshadow base from NYX. Next, I'm just going to set that base with a white eyeshadow. I'm using one from the Suva Beauty Pro Palette. Next, I'm going to start uh, sketching out a cut crease. Also, as you can see, I put some of that white base in my eyebrows, just lighten them up. So I'm just going to start sketching the cut crease. I'm going to do it a lot larger than I would usually do because I want her eyes to appear very big. So I'm just taking this sparkly blue um, eyeshadow from Sephora and just sketching that out with a little brush. sparkly blue eyeshadow. I'm just going to start um, filling in the outer and inner corners. Just patting it on. And then once I have less product, I'm just going to lightly pat it to fade it into the white. In with my Suva Beauty Pro Palette, I'm taking this shimmery blue right here called Le Vu, and I'm gonna darken up the inner and outer corners. Going back in with the Suva Palette, I'm gonna take the black called Coal, and I'm just gonna darken the inner corner. I'm still using that same little, little eyeshadow brush. Next, I'm gonna go in and draw a mega eyeliner. That's pretty gonna much, pretty gonna much, pretty much going to follow this huge wing we did right here. I'm using the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper. Next, I'm going to go in with the color Fiji here from the Suva palette, and I'm going to put that over my eyebrow, but not all the way as you can see like I did on the other eye. Next, just going in with Sea Breeze here. It's the same color I used, but a shimmery shade. I'm just gonna pop that using my finger right on top of what we just did. I'm just going to go in with a little bit of black eyeshadow and darken up right in front of my brow right here. Alright, time to draw some evil brows. I'm going in with some black face paint. This one is from Mayron. And I'm starting off where my natural brow starts and just going to pull it up and drag it down. line at the top here of the cut crease. I'm going to go in with some 
silver glitter and just add that underneath my fake eyebrow as a kind of glittery highlight. Then I'm just gonna go in with a smudger brush and some black eyeshadow and just continue the lash line. The lash line. Continue the line underneath. Yeah, underneath the lash line. God. <laughs> so. Uh, so. Then I'm just gonna diffuse that a bit with a round smudge brush. Going back in with the Suva palette, I'm going with the, in with the color Pearl, and I'm gonna use that as my inner corner highlight. All right, I'm gonna finish off the eyes a little later. Uh, my eyes tend to get a little bit sensitive sometimes, so in those cases, I like to move on and then at the end, go finish off the rest of the eyes. Now I'm going to contour and I'm using the NYX blush in taupe. This is their old packaging by the way. It don't look like that anymore. I'm going to go pretty intense with this. to darken it up even more, I'm going to be adding a dark grey eyeshadow. This one is from Sephora. Next I'm going to add some blush. This is Baby Doll from NYX. Next we're going to add some highlight. We're going to strobe the shit out of our face. Um, this is actually my highlight, my go-to highlight I've been using um, lately. This is Hard Candy. It's a kind of trio thing and this one is three times a charm. You can get these at Walmart and this was just under $10. And if you're really pale like me, uh, this highlight is amazing. So it's this one right here. Damn. All right, so now I'm going to do the lips. I'm going to be filling them in with Jeffree Star Blue Velvet Liquid Lipstick. highlight to the middle of the lip. I'm using the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Drug Lord White Liquid Lipstick. All right, now finally back to the eyes. Pretty much all I have left is to do my waterline. I'm gonna put some white. This is a NYX pencil. And then I'm just going to apply false lashes and mascara off camera and I'll be right back. All right, so next we're gonna draw the dress. So what I'm doing is I'm taking Lagoon Blue um, body paint from Mayron and the white, I'm mixing it together. And I'm putting that shit, um, yeah, I'm putting that shit on. Gonna add a little bit of texture with that white Mayron face paint and a sea sponge. Next, I'm going to 
going in again with the Suva Beauty Pro Palette and going in with this royal blue here called Coast. And we're gonna add some blue. We're gonna add some blue. Then with that black eyeshadow again, we're gonna start adding some depth to the clothes. Alright, so I'm looking at my overall design and I like it, but I'm like, there's something missing. There's gotta be a bit of contrast. There's too much blue. I gotta add some blood. So, well, not real blood. But I'm going in with some red face paint. This one is from Wolf. And I'm just gonna use that same sea sponge and splatter some of that shit on my clothes. I gotta add some more to the face. I'm gonna add some bloody tears. So here is the final look. 